hey guys welcome back to our channel i hope everybody is doing well today is monday it is almost two o'clock in the evening and your girl is tired as y'all are coming in please make sure y'all hit that subscribe button if you are not already subscribed make sure if you are subscribed then you have your bell hit to get all your notifications and please make sure y'all give this video a thumbs up and also if you are not subscribe to our second channel mom life one day at a time the link is in the description box below i also have hauls over there i just uploaded one today right before this video it was a walmart haul that i did yesterday which was sunday so if you guys are interested in seeing that walmart haul please go over there and check that out make sure y'all are subscribed over there and y'all bells are hit to receive all of the notifications and make sure y'all thumbs up those videos over there also so let me see what I'm going to start because I have a lot of stuff today. We went to two different Walmarts. Um, and like I said, I went to Walmart yesterday. I still have to go to Sam's, but it probably won't be until the end of this week because it, we've been getting a lot of rain here in Mississippi. It's just been bad um, in a lot of different areas. So I just went on and got what I know I needed to get just in case, you know, um, a lot of areas and stuff do get flooded. So no, I'm not explaining. I'm talking to you guys because I do have people that's new that's just coming onto the channel and they may not have watched all of my hauls or my vlogs, so they may not know how we do. But everything that I buy lasts for the month. So just like those cereal, I got those cereal like two weeks ago and they still have some left. So I didn't have to buy cereal. So when I buy, I bulk buy. So usually when I go back to the store and pick up every other week or every two weeks, I only have to get what I'm low or short on. And so this haul here that like the meat and stuff that I got is going to be for the month. The canned goods is going to be for the month. So these snacks and stuff that I got will last for the month. Even though I have older kids in the house, they buy their own stuff. So what you see snack wise is going to last. The stuff that I will say that I have to restock up on every week or every two weeks, I will say that. So the snacks I have pork skins the cool ranch doritos i just got the tostitos um, bite size and my mom got her thing of pretzels and then i got cheeto puffs for philip if he want them for whatever day i got another thing of plates and i am going to get some more plates i just grabbed those y'all know i like the actual brand name but they was out so i said i'm gonna try the great value and see rance had picked up a thing of pepsi and i like these y'all it has a lot of extra proteins and stuff in them. So I got two of these so I can snack on at night. I asked my mom if she wanted honey buns and she said no. But I guarantee you guys one day she's going to eat a honey bun. I like to heat mine up in the microwave. So she's going to be like, you got some more honey buns. And I was going to get the minis, but I just got those. Because I can also give Philip like half of one in his lunchbox one day, half the other day. And then I got two um deep dish pie shells and i just got two i'm only gonna I, well i got four pie shells but i got two packs i'm only gonna make two but i know i want to do either a apple pie or something probably within the next two weeks and i'll just have those yeah i'll turn it on when i'm done so i got those so i will be making that today i'm gonna turn my oven on in a second so i can preheat it because i am gonna um do my sweet potatoes in the oven and then I'll come over here <laughs> I got a thing of buns and bread. Rianse says she's probably going to fix her burger. I've had burgers already. I just want me a quick little taco salad. So I'm going to make enough for me for me a taco salad. And I guess they can do burgers or whatever while we got ground beef out. And y'all know Dawn, they got their new power wash. And when I seen it, I was like, I want to try that. I want to try and see if it works. So I'm going to use this just for like if we have dishes that's like a little bit more greasier. And that's the only time I'm going to use this. So I want to see if it really will work out. And if it works, I'm going to let y'all know. And I don't remember the price. It wasn't that much. I think it was like $2, two dollars and something, $3 and something. So, yeah. And they got the apple scent. I just got the regular fresh scent. And then, of course, I got my finished power balls for the dishwasher. I got me some um, toilet tissue. And my mom wanted some Snapple. So I got her the Snapple, the Kiwi, Strawberry. And I'm going to get her a big thing when I do go to Sam's. Because I know, I, and I'm just going to buy some because the kids, everybody like it. Snuggle, y'all know I like to just mix, dip, well, mix some laundry detergent in my spray bottle. And I use that like as a Febreze and I use it on 
everything like the couch the curtains my bed all of that so i was out so i picked up me another one my mama went on and got another thing a lysol sanitizer laundry sanitizer and if y'all remember that vlog y'all know just what i'm talking about my mama was like i'll buy some more i use it i'll buy some more and then she picked up a thing of the gain hawaiian aloha scent washing powder a laundry detergent i got a cranberry grape and this these juices are for everybody they're not just for me so i want to be clear but because i'm trying to cut back on my sodas well i don't drink sodas a whole lot but i'll be wanting different juices and different things so i got the cranberry grape and i asked everybody what they wanted and they was like whatever you get so i got the cranberry grape the cranberry pineapple and then i just got one hawaiian punch and i got me a gold peak tea i did pick these up for myself and then i got these grape waters for me and philip so he'll get three and i'll get three and then i got the lemon and you know at walmart you can buy the big pack like that that they come or you can just tear them apart and get so many and y'all know it's six in a pack so it's 24 of them so I, and those are just the lemon flavor waters and i got 20, 40 and these are the berry blends and y'all know they don't come in a big pack so you got to buy 20 individually so i got those for my little one lunch i got both in the berry blends and then over here since i'm here i'm gonna just start with the beef y'all know i always get two packs of these big 10 pound rolls and then we cut them up and y'all already know if y'all know if y'all watch y'all know how i do i take one pack and cut them in a six i think yeah i take one and cut in a six or is it eight i don't remember y'all tell me do y'all remember <laughs> one two three four one two three yeah six i think one i do six and one we do like five or four something like that y'all don't let me lie but one of them we cut in more than the other i'm tired right now okay y'all and then i got two packs of chicken wings I didn't want to just do the frozen individual wingettes because I wanted a whole wing, you know, with the flat and the drumstick part on there. So I got two packs. But sometimes you just want something different. And then I got two more um, of the Sanderson form chicken, the whole chicken, because, you know, we want whole fried chicken sometimes. And then I thought this was a really good deal. Um, I know they didn't have these last month. So when I seen them this month, I went on and got me two packs of them. And they were, let me see, I'm trying to see the pounds. And it's no steroids added, no added hormones or steroids. And it is, oh, 10 pounds. It's a 10 pound value and it was $4.99 at Walmart. So I got two bags of them. So I got 20 pounds of um, drumsticks. Ten dollars, so I thought that was a really good deal. Um, and I didn't want to get three or four packs or nothing because I'm like, I didn't need that many. And even though I like to buy in bulk, I don't want to buy and just waste or buy just because it's there. Um, because I'm just I know we're not gonna eat that much, you know what I mean? Like, so I just got um two 10 pounds, so like I said, 20 pounds for ten dollars is a really good deal. And y'all know I just use my Ziploc bag and divide my chickens up, so between. The wings, the whole chickens, and these um, were fine. And then I already still had chicken breast that's in the freezer. So I wasn't going to buy any more chicken breast. And if y'all seen that haul, then you guys know that I also just went and bought the chicken tenderloins. Because I will be making a chicken and crawfish Cajun Alfredo pasta <laughs> that was a lot to say i was gonna do it yesterday but i didn't then i said i was gonna do it today but like i said it's now it's after two o'clock and it's getting late in the evening so i'll make it tomorrow and then i'll still have some chicken tenderloins left i got a thing of smoked turkey necks and i got a thing of smoked turkey wings because i will be putting one of these and one of these when I do my red beans and I will be doing red beans Sunday because it's our Mardi Gras parade and then when I get ready to do the other ones one of these are going to go in some butter beans and one of them is going to go into my fresh green beans and the same with these yeah and then I got the sizzle steak I asked Rante and she was like yep she wanted these and y'all know these is just a beef cut shoulder and I'll just fix these one day with something probably some potatoes and just kind of dice them up with some salt and pepper or whatever on them or something um but it'll be a meal 
for a day. And then we got the cube steak. So these will be another meal for a day. And this is a big size pack. They got a lot in there. And then Renate had wanted some of the sirloin tip thins. Yeah, I said that right. <laughs> the beef sirloin tip thins. And they're thinly sliced. So I don't know. One day I'll make this with a meal and probably just do some rice or something over it. And some corn or something and just kind of make it like into a more mexican style dish or whatever but we'll see or a spanish dish and then i got a london brawl y'all know i love london brawls i am a huge london brawl person i will just eat i will take this meat and literally just make it with some potatoes and be gone you hear me and be in heaven so i went on and got this but i think what i'm gonna do is just put it in my casora cooker and just smother it down and do some carrots, potatoes, and something. Not necessarily doing it into a roast. So that'll be for a meal one day. So like I said, I'm, I'll am be stocked up for the month. And then I got a thing of the Koneka sausage because that's going to go into the red beans. Um, and I just did this brand because I really like this in gumbo and red beans. So that's what that'll be for. And then I got the Richard's. Don't know that number. I got the Richard's. Um, crazy cajun smoked sausage and this is right out of louisiana also so i got this big pack but this will just be and it's four pounds so that'll just be just for the month then i got me one snapple and this is the strawberry pineapple lemonade i was hoping they made it in a big six packs like that but they don't these are ones you buy for a dollar and they only have one left i got mama some cut okra and she got her one pack of broccoli. I asked her how many she wanted. She said she just wanted one each. And I'll get her some more when I go to restock up. Then I got me three sweet potatoes. Because I said my meat. I'm going to remake my pie and give my brother the other one. I got some Velveeta slices for their burgers or whatever. Then I get me the Sargento. Because I like the Sargento brand with my tacos and my burgers. But they don't care what brand. They'll do Velveeta or Kraft. They just don't do the Walmart brand. And then I got the Velveeta again, the cheddar, cheddar original and mozzarella. That's for when we have tacos. I got two things of rice because one is just going to be for the house and then one so we can go ahead on and fix for um, Mardi Gras for Sunday for the Mardi Gras parade. And then the Spanish style Uncle Ben's rice. I like to get this so when I have my tacos, I mix it in with my tacos and my corn. So I do a full taco salad. I mix rice and corn with it i got two things of the tub imperial butter instead of doing the country crop because it was cheaper this was like two dollars and i got two of them for four and then the imperial was like four something so i still came out better they didn't have the head of lettuce so i just got the shredded lettuce i was going to shred it anyway for my tacos and then i got the classic iceberg salad tomatoes I got the Imperial Butter. I will just be freezing these. And it's just the sticks. I know I need one for my sweet potatoes. Well, not. I just need one stick for my sweet potato pie. Um, the rest, like I said, I'm going to freeze. I got a thing of grapes. The taco seasoning. I'm going to just need one pack for my tacos. The rest will be put up. I got some Ambrosia apples, of course, for my little one. Because he likes the Ambrosia. I got me a thing of lemonade. Two. Um things of bananas one vegetable oil one gallon of milk and then i got my fresh green beans and when i do get ready to smother them down and sh i'll share that i got me two more bell peppers i did get one yesterday but i went only got two more today because i'm gonna need some for my seasoning for my beans and then i got my strawberries i got two packs of strawberries and i got two packs of the baker's dipping sauce because i want me some chocolate covered strawberries i had a little bit for valentine's day and it just got me in my feelings so i want to make some <laughs> so i got um these here i got the louisiana ones so i can use for um, my chocolate covered strawberries and then i'll just have this extra pack just at the house for another day and then these strawberries are just to eat i got my little one i just got the kids i'm not gonna say my little one i got um the kids another pack of pizza rolls and then when i make my tacos i also like to use the beef um chorizo i don't get the pork i used to get the pork but yeah since i'm cutting back on my pork intake considerably <laughs> i went on and got the beef and if y'all have never added the beef chorizo to y'all tacos with y'all meat 
try it. And also it's this other dish that I used to make and my dad had gave me the recipe a long time ago. I'll get the chorizo um, cheese and then a mozzarella and then I'll brown the meat and just add the cheese and then use it like a dipping sauce. So it's kind of like you do a meat and cheese sauce, but you use a chorizo. You can add beef, like your ground beef and stuff to it if you want to stretch it. But y'all, it's that beef and cheese. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, and then I got another brand of hot links. Y'all know I just want me a hot sauce sandwich every now and then. And then I got two things of hot dogs. One of these are going to be for hot dogs for Sunday for Mardi Gras. I'm going to put them in the oven because I'm not doing no grill and everybody out partying and I'm cooking. So I'm putting them in the oven. And the other one I'm going to freeze because it'll be for just the month for Philip or hot dogs. For, for Philip or when we have hot dogs or chili dogs because we still have some hot dogs in the refrigerator. And then the beans. As you see, we got 10 cans. Usually I get the taller cans, but they were sold out. Everybody been buying these blue runners. So we just got 10 and we got all the original. And yes, all 10 are going to be for the parade. My mom bought these and I bought the hot dogs. Um, and then I got 12 cans of peas and 12 cans of green beans. Um, we just kept them on a little tray. So I'm going to keep them on a little tray. And I just got the regular cut. We have corn. We already have a lot of corn. So I didn't need corn. Um, and I buy canned goods to last for the month. But we don't eat canned goods every day. Um, and Because we, like I said, we still got a lot left. And I haven't bought canned goods in a while. The last time I did, I think I only picked up like two or three cans. So these here plus the corn we got would definitely last us to like the end of March because we really don't eat them that often. And then I got two things of 18 count eggs. And am I done? Did I tell y'all everything? Let me look again because I showed y'all the water. And like I said, that's just the Nestle. That's the, all of those are lemon. I think I shared everything, y'all. I think I'm about done because I'm tired. You girl just... Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, I shared everything with y'all. Oh, and these are the cupcakes that I had got um and I had shared in the last video. And like I said these was the only two they had left from the other pack. So yeah, so that's it, y'all. And my mama been doing laundry before we left, and when we got back, so I'm about to turn that dry back on. Um and yeah. Oh, and somebody else had asked, how often do I give my little one Kool-Aid jammers? If y'all remember when we went and bought all of that laundry detergent and stuff, that was what, three weeks or so ago? And I had bought this pack for him. It was the grape, cherry, and tropical punch. He haven't opened a cherry at all. He haven't opened a tropical punch. And he still has like five of the grapes left. So all he's had drunk was like five out of there within two weeks. So we go through a lot of water here. Um, if you are new... I, I suggest that you just kind of go and watch some of them so you can kind of get a handle on who we are and what we are and how we do. And, and of course, if you know us, then you know us and we need no explanation. So until the next video, we will see you later. We love you guys. Please make sure y'all hit that subscribe button on the way out. If you are not already subscribed and make sure y'all bell is set to all and y'all like this video and make sure y'all comment in the comment section below i will have a video of me cooking when i do my crawfish and chicken pasta it will be on my other channel mom life so if y'all want to know what that's going to be that's what it's going to be so i'll see y'all later and please remember to go and look at my grocery haul from yesterday and that's on my other channel also and the link is in the description box below so i'll see y'all later bye guys